Hello, my lovely Sagittarius. I hope everybody's well. Sagis today will do your reading for the 3rd and the 4th of October. As you know, this is a general read. Might resonate with you, love, might not. Take accordingly and, of course, leave what's not necessary for you. So let's see here, Sagis, what we got for you for today in your overall energy and how we're moving forward for the Sagittarius. All right, loves. We have four of wands. A good opportunity to get together with this person you are thinking of. I definitely see a celebration coming to fruition for some of you. But definitely stability is on the way. Awesome. And I definitely see here, Sag, you manifested that. For many of you, you say, we have the same story. Whatever card says, and whatever spirit says about you, loves, I will say it. There's nothing in here I don't do besides the cameras. You see it, and I never, I never do the readings and, you know, redo or move it around the camera or whatever you see in the video, okay? So every single video of mine, it's a raw video. It's not redo, it is not edited, no. It's a raw video, okay? So we have Page of Cups, Loves, Death, Queen of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, and Eight of Wands. The Harfland, Two of Pentacles, and Knight of Cups. All right, loves. I definitely see here you might deal with somebody who is committed with somebody or you could be and somebody who is offering you something new. I definitely see here you could deal with somebody new or could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, we have Scorpio, also we have Taurus and we have Virgo here. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn with the Queen of Pentacles. I definitely see here a situation which was very, very unhealthy, I will call it here. It is over. Something it is over. This earth sign might come back after something ended with you and offer you an apology. Although I don't see you taking it. I see you, Sagis. You feel like this was too crazy. Nine of Swords, Ten of Swords, and the Devil. This was very, very difficult situation for you. And put you in a karmic relationship and such and such. Definitely we have Taurus Virgo Capricorn here in this reading. And a water sign. Could be a fellow Sag for you loves. Because I definitely see here, if you had such a tumultuous relationship with this or sign, that's over. Whatever was difficult to hear, it is over. And I feel here the universe is moving you towards something better. Although, I definitely see you still indecisive in here. For some of you, you just kind of like... I like the pain this person gave it to me and you still kind of stuck or the person who you've been before it's still stuck on you some of you either you Sag are stuck on this person either they are stuck on you if this earth sign comes with an apology they are the ones stuck if you are the one who apologized after something ended, because definitely Ten of Swords, death, something ended here with an earth sign. The universe is telling you, move forward. And this is the divine time. You are on the right path. And it's okay for you to end with this person. Because you are better off without this person. 
And yes, could be a karmic situation. This person could be binded with somebody else or could be in another relationship because I definitely see here it is somebody you've been stuck for for quite a bit here. But I definitely see here now you need to make a decision with one of these people you are ending. And I definitely see here something new, a new offer, something great come towards you. You just need to choose because I see you very much like I'm not sure. But this person who is coming towards you is a divine partner. Could be somebody you know from another past life. I definitely see that energy. Also, this is good for long term. Is a good potential for stability in here with this person. Okay, if you are dealing with the water sign, what you ending, when you ending, could be the other person want to give you that stability and vice versa. But I, I basically see here, you choose to, to be happy. Absolutely. But let's see here. For some of you, you might communicate with this person with this ace of one, uh, eight of wands from a distance. This person might apologize, they might open up their emotions, but I don't see you taking it here. I definitely see here you are open to communicate with this person, but you know that this person breadcrumbed you in the past. They've been very, very secretive, very, very much backed off with their energy, very much like not sharing too much, not sharing any emotions or something at that extent. But let's see here, what's this communication about here for the Sagittarius star? If you want it with this, with this Aquarian energy, if you wanted to talk with this person, this will happen. If this person really wants to talk to you, they will talk with you in any matter. Let's see here what the decision you will make or why you're so indecisive, what you don't know here, why you're so back and forth with yourself and you don't really know what to do because you're still stuck in the past. Whatever was in the past put you in such a way like was heavy for you. Also, I definitely see here was a third party in the past. And for you, Sag, this is you. You need to move away from that energy. One more card. And you know that if you will stay, because the Queen of Wands is sitting down on this chair, if you will stay in that vibration, you always will be back and forth with your energy. And I feel here that's why the, the universe in, intervention here for you to see... Because this is you, Sag, your car, Jupiter. You need to see beyond that. And it tells you that the past cannot be changed. Look forward to the future. And live in the present. Be happy in the present. Okay? Let's see here. This offer of love. Very curious about this offer of love. How it looks. Moving on, I feel here you choose to move on, and yes, seems very good offer for you. It's a very stable, very good offer here with this Ace of Pentacles. It's about stability, and I definitely see here the universe tells you it is safe for you to love, it is safe for you to move forward because this is stable, this is grounded, this is good. This is a very good opportunity for you to move forward in love, in care. For some of you, you are moving towards a different location. You might change the home. For some of you, you might change even the jobs. But I definitely see the abundance is on the way to you. Although I definitely see you very much healing, which is good to you. Heal is good, reflecting is good, and movement forward. Absolutely. King of Cups. 
again water sign energy so love yes I definitely see here you choose what you would like to have what you love and it's a good energy yeah so I love whatever you leaving behind and move forward and Sag I'm very happy forward to see how this union will happen I definitely see you are choosing stability at this time and not staying in that mugginess past yeah all right Sagittarius this is what I got for you today many blessings to all of you and of course we'll see you tomorrow bye for now